Okay, so this question isn't actually a circle theorem, but it is one that we use with circle theorems all the time. And it's important to spot that this is no ordinary triangle. This triangle is isosceles. Now, we all know that with an isosceles triangle, when drawn like this, with the two uh, lengths that are the same like that, then these two bottom angles here are equal. So this angle here is going to be equal to this angle here. Now if those two are 70, that's 140 in total. So we're going to do 180, which is angles in a triangle, take away two lots of 70, which equals, so that's 140 and 180 take away 140, so that equals 40 degrees. Now not only do we need to write down the answer, it's really important we write down the reason why and you just say isosceles triangle. Try and be as descriptive as you can so I might write uh, the two angles in isosceles triangle are equal or something like that. Um, there's no fixed sentence you have to write as long as you've got the word isosceles um, and then the person marking it will identify that you realize they were the same. And marking things on the diagram is really helpful as well. So when I'm marking these, seeing that written on the diagram, you can actually get credited marks for drawing the angles on the, to the diagram, but you must also have a written explanation as well.